Hold your back. We have one victim that was possibly shot at because it stemmed from an altercation between those two. But everything's dark. Hang on to the evidence act. Just the evidence act here. Mansella, first name spelled E R W I N, last name M A N A N S A L A, Lieutenant San Diego Police Department. Okay, and if you can just look at me and just yeah. uh, so what brought you guys here? Okay, uh, officers were dispatched to a call of gunfire heard in uh, the area of Nantasket and Oceanfront Walk. Uh, when they arrived on scene, uh, we were getting updates from the caller that initially called that they had seen a male with a rifle discharging it in the area. It's not clear if he was discharging in the air or at someone. Uh, when officers arrived on scene, they located uh, several rifle casings on the, uh, walk, the boardwalk over there. Um, and then while we're doing witness checks and everything like that, we were able to locate a uh, supposed victim that uh, basically possibly got shot at. So talking to that victim, it appears that he, the victim was riding his bike on the boardwalk out here when the suspect presented himself. They got into some type of verbal altercation um, as the bike rider victim continued northbound on the boardwalk, he saw the rifle produce a right or saw the suspect produce a rifle and start hearing gunfire and the victim rode off in the opposite direction. So And while you guys were surrounding the house, uh, some of you were pulled up or something? Correct. So while we were surrounding the house, we weren't clear if the suspect had gone back inside or had left. The one of the witnesses that was on the, the uh, phone was on the phone with our dispatch room basically said they saw him last seen northbound on foot, but we, we could not confirm that. So as units were setting a perimeter out here and searching the immediate vicinity with our helicopter, uh, an Uber driver uh, gave some information to one of the officers when they asked who, was gonna, who they were picked up, and they named the suspect by name. And you guys, it's just like a block away, you rushed him, you got him in, in about? Yeah, approximately three blocks from here, uh, they located the suspect, they took him to custody without incident, uh, and 
he's currently in custody and has been positively identified as the uh, suspect discharging the rifle. Couple, uh, a rifle and a shotgun, is it, or a rifle, rifle gun? Inside? At this time, I believe we've located at least one firearm, a rifle type, inside the house. I cannot confirm on the second one. Gotcha. So this, yeah. this this bike guy, he was just a guy randomly riding up the boardwalk, not not the guy that lives across from the original address. Okay. From the initial information that I've received, yes, it believes he has no affiliation with the suspect whatsoever. He just happened to be uh, riding his bike northbound on the boardwalk. Uh, some words were exchanged, and as a bike rider kept on drive, uh, riding his bike northbound, uh, the suspect produced a rifle and started discharging. Any, this, any clarity this... on the words that were exchanged, or you guys can you still figure that out? Uh, we're still obtaining more detailed witness statements at this time. Um, is this guy known, well known to um, officers? Have you guys been here before? I personally can't speak to that. We're still doing records checks to confirm whether we've had prior police contacts with him at this point. So. Smashed up home assault rifles. It sounds kind of like the one from last year with the crazy guy in Mid City. So, like I said, I, I'm not familiar with that incident. We, we yeah. noticed a, a dog uh, with or, or around the suspect when he was taken into custody. Correct. Was that his? Yes. Is any, was anybody else found in the home? No, the house clear, was clear when we did a, a check the welfare security sweep inside the house for any potential other victims or injured persons. And where does the dog go now? Uh, if a family member can't take custody of the, the dog, the, the dog will be uh, remanded to the Humane Society and he can be picked up by family members or friends at a later time. What charges is the suspect facing? At minimum, discharging a firearm uh, in a negligent manner. Uh, if we can confirm that he was shooting at the, the victim that was on the bike, then it'll be assault with a deadly weapon, discharging firearms as well. And where was the gun located? Uh, I'm not, I was not part of the entry team. I know it was in, uh, located, I believe, in one of the bedrooms, from inside what I understand. The so, inside the home, correct. Yeah. All right.